Hello and welcome to Physics Hub. Today in this video we are going to announce a very important thing which the JEST authority has uploaded on their website. So as I told you in the last video that the JEST 2023 examination has been postponed and they did not mention any date but now one day before they have announced the date. So the new date 26th of March, March 26th 2023. It will be from 10 a.m. to 1 p.m. So this is the new JS 2023 examination date. Although it is classing with few of the examination uh, like Rajasthan set or some other examination, I don't know exactly. But what you can do if you are also preparing for those examination, you can email, you can send an email to the JEST authority using your attaching your admit card or the notification date or the no exam date notification okay wherever the exam date is written you can attach that document in uh, with your email so that they can be aware of that of those dates and they can change it because the other exam dates cannot be changed only the just 2023 examination date may be changed so there is a high possibility that this is not the finalized date it may be uh, postponed later on also so you, you have to email if you don't send email then it is not going to change automatically nothing happens um, by automatical by automatic means you have to do something okay now what what, what I was talking about syllabus of the JEST examination. So may almost uh, many of you know about the JEST 2023 examination syllabus but uh, those students who are like giving the examination for the first time they may think that all the nine units of CSI and field science syllabus are there in the JEST exam syllabus but that is not the case. Few subjects are not there in the JEST examination. So let me tell you which subjects are there in the JEST 2023 examination syllabus. Those Topics are mathematical methods, classical mechanics, electromagnetics, electromagnetism and optics, quantum mechanics, thermodynamics and statistical physics, electronics. Only these six topics are there in the JEST examination. No other subjects are there in the JEST examination. Now, although you are preparing well for the examination, here I will be sharing with you five important tips which may help you during these, uh, these days till your examination happens so first of all start early and be consistent with your studies so get up early in the morning and plan your day accordingly so that you can get maximum output from your preparation and point number two solve as many problems as possible you can solve uh, previous year problems and some important questions from other examination like tifr net exam so those uh, questions will definitely help you in attempting your just 2023 examination paper third focus on your weak areas Okay, and revise them regularly. This is the time you can focus on your weak areas, but don't start anything new, which uh, some topics you may find difficult, but you have covered uh, somehow. So just try to revise them by you can fix some of the some of your time of, of the day and you can just revise those weak areas so that they can be strong by the examination date. Number four, develop a strong conceptual understanding of the topics rather than just memorizing formula. Sometimes we just keep on memorizing formulae. But that is true to some extent, like some topics are there uh, where you can invest your time, but that will not give you much output. But there are some topics where you need to understand those topics very well. So don't take like extreme high or extreme low, take a mid up approach. Okay, that will help you in long run. And last tip, tip number five, take care of your physical and mental health to stay focused and motivated. I have seen many students that uh, before few days of your examination, many of you get depressed or demotivated. So I'll tell you that uh, keep believe in yourself. Okay, keep, uh, keep your <clears throat> hope in yourself. Don't lose your confidence. You have prepared well, you have done well till now. And in the next few days, you have to work harder don't get demotivated and keep on doing your preparation and I, ho I hope you will do very well in the examination. Now, uh, <clears throat> uh, five tips I have uh, shared for the preparation stage. Now, I would like to share five tips during the examination which you should follow. So, tip number one, read the question carefully and manage your time wisely. Okay. So, it is uh, many times uh, what we do, we don't read the question very carefully. We, okay, we see that, okay, this is a question, oh, this is a familiar question and we start solving it and end up getting a wrong answer. So, you have to read it carefully exactly what the question is asking to you. Okay, it may be similar, similar problem, but you have to understand the language. 
it may happen that it is asking you another information not the information which you have uh, thought in the first class okay number two attempt the easier questions first and then move on to the difficult ones for just exam especially uh, you have to follow this strategy for gate exams you know there are many number of questions and few questions are easy few questions are difficult so there also this strategy applies you have to solve the easier question first because in your just examination you you don't need to attend all the whole total whole question paper even if you uh, let's say attempt uh, 50 to 60 percent correctly then that is well enough to get a good rank or good score so keep that thing in mind number three use the process of elimination to narrow down your options okay so sometimes uh, it may happen that you don't know the exact solution or if you do the direct solution it may take a lot of time lot of space so what you can do out of those four options you may think that these options this option cannot be the correct option at any circumstance so you can just cross that next remaining from the remaining three options try to eliminate options this is one way another way um, the similar type of way is uh, using the dimension analysis technique that uh, in that way also you can uh, eliminate options and some other techniques which I have repeatedly told you during the classes so you can follow them number four use the MCQ choose the MCQ options carefully let's say you have solved a problem you got an answer now while choosing the option in the OMR sheet or in the maybe for online examination when you are choosing choose very carefully let's say you have decided to click on option C or choose option C but while actually filling the uh, option you are choosing option B that should not happen okay that will give you too much of regret after the examination okay number five don't panic if you get stuck on a question that is very normal lot of students get stuck in problems you may be uh, you may not be able to solve uh, five consecutive questions or six consecutive questions but don't lose hope just don't waste your time in those questions but just keep on moving the, uh, the motto you have to set in your mind that you have to keep on moving so in this way keep on moving and those questions which you could not attempt you come back later and try them once again and hopefully you will be able to solve them now uh, before ending the video i would like to tell you that just 2020 examination is not only a test of your knowledge but it is also a test of your accuracy and critical thinking so remember that and keeping these things in mind uh, you go into an examination even if you don't cover all the syllabus that uh, that is okay sometimes we cannot uh, prepare for the syllabus but the, the time time is not there so whatever portion of syllabus you have covered till now just revise them keep uh, keep on practicing problems based on them and if you give like hundred percent of whatever you have practiced then that will be enough okay so this is all for this video guys I hope these tips will help you in your just 20 examination and see you guys in the next video till then bye bye take care Anacademy is India's largest online teaching learning platform. You can prepare for various competitive exams like CSR, NET, GET, GEST, IIT JAM, TFR. Especially if you are preparing for CSR, NET, Physical Science, you can join me on Anacademy Plus. I cover all the nine units of CSR, NET, Physical Science syllabus. My approach is especially I precisely give you the concept of the concerned topic. Then I discuss the relevant mathematical formula and do the analysis. Relevant problem based on the topic, including previous year questions, are discussed. Homework and assignments are also given. This is my profile and if you want to join my Anacademy Plus process, you can enroll for this course. And if you are new to this Anacademy uh, platform, you can take Anacademy Plus subscription using our referral code Felix app. And Anacademy will give you 10% off. So take the Anacademy Plus subscription today and put your feet one step ahead towards reaching your goal. Thank you.